Oh my god. Oh my god. Hi everybody. So welcome to my channel. This is Kriti and last week I uploaded this video about the renovation work that is happening in my building. And I just wanted to show you what is going on. What's the current situation. I have installed the toilet downstairs. I'm going to show you that also. And yes, even though uh, like there is no water, you just cannot use the toilet and in the kitchen. You just cannot do anything. It's still manageable, I think, here in Denmark. And I'm going to show you everything. So stay tuned. And yes, if you are new to my channel, welcome to my okay yeah this is one part of my house this entire pipe system yeah they have just opened it <laughs> so yeah if you are new to my channel uh, do check my other videos and if you like my content do subscribe to my channel now let's get started with this week's video but here is the entire bathroom setup which is totally changed right now they have removed the basin and there used to be commode that they have removed it and they have kept it here so it's here which means you just cannot use the water and they've also put the red tape here and as i mentioned in the previous blog that we have given our keys uh, to them so that they can come to our house without any problem but this is what they do they first knock if you are not in the house then they use the keys so today i was like for the first time i was in the house and they knocked i opened the door and then they said uh, english or danish i said english and then they started the work because for last uh, two three days i've been going to my friend's place now yesterday i went to my friend's place and in the evening when i came back i saw that they have put red tape everywhere in the basin in the bathroom and the kitchen we have been not using it for last uh, two three like over the weekend we could not use it it's a big project that is going on so this is the toilet that they've installed there are three and i'm gonna go now in one of them and they have given us the key so that it is always locked and you go in and then when you come out you also lock it This is the toilet that they have installed and it has everything. So here is the commode, here is the basin, there is a mirror, which, then they have the toilet paper and here you can also take a shower. Right now there is no hot water coming so that's the problem but they are looking into it but you have proper water. Yes. And they also have like a place where you can hang stuff there's a actually there's a place to sit and what's impressive is that they actually have heater as well so it's good to switch off the light open, open the door come out then i have the keys i'm gonna lock it and it's locked to let you know about uh, what we are doing with food because we just can't cook in Copenhagen no one thing that is really nice is definitely the takeaway service so you can definitely order something like last evening we had pizza so that was our dinner but one of the things that is also very good in Denmark is all the ready-made food that you can get in the supermarket so they have ready-made salad or things that just need to go in the microwave or just need to you know even go in the oven so this is a day two of living without any access to water in the apartment and also having no toilet facility in the apartment so what i did actually is like i came to fitness center and took a shower and now i'm going back home and then i will go out but 
बट या दिस इज स्टिल मैनेजेबल विदाउट एनी फैसिलिटी इन द हाउस इज लॉट ऑफ कंस्ट्रक्शन गोइंग ऑन राइट नाउ लाइक नियर वेर आई स्टे लुक एट दिस कंस्ट्रक्शन साइट so i am here at the co-working space today and uh, working uh, with uh, new people and i have with me nancy hi <laughs> who works for joes and co's and uh, i must say i am having very good time and got to meet new people so just done with the co-working uh, networking event very nice to meet new people after so long now i am going uh, home so this blog i started with showing you how is life when there is no access to water and the bathroom in copenhagen but it's turning out to be showing you my life what i do in a day or something so yeah and you can see behind me there's water there is also construction going on here where i came in copenhagen i think these days i am seeing constructions going on everywhere everywhere you go there is some construction going on in copenhagen so i am back home and i am opening the door and i don't know if they have put back the things in the house let's find out together okay so no oh my god oh my god okay 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 i'm going to show you what work is going on so look at this thing yeah that's one thing that has been removed like the water for the bathroom this thing is out all right so i'm going to end this blog the work is still going on there is still no access to water and toilet system in the house but as i mentioned they have the downstairs uh, temporary uh, toilet installed so we are using that one maybe i'll make another blog when things gets done and how it is to go back to normal but uh, yes thank you so much for watching the video and today's dinner is from to good to go app and uh, i will talk more about that app and uh, how can you save money when you use the app here in denmark thank you so much for watching this week's blog do subscribe to my channel if you want to know more about uh, denmark in the future and i will see you next week till then bye bye